Welcome to another educational video from the Learn Persian.us team. So let's take a sneak peek at the scene we are going to watch. In this video, a man who works at a car company is driving one of their customers' cars through her house and deliver it after service. He's been a bit late and the woman is expecting him to arrive soon. He then reaches the place and starts talking to the woman. من خیلی از شما از خواهی میکنم الان دارم میرسم خدمت ببخش ببخش بله بله چقدر خوشگیله چقدر چقدر نمیشه بوبرم نمیشه تو اینقدر احساساتی باشی میرسی از اطور منه ببخش دیم گاز تنگیره مذارت میسوم میشه بابی جان برو اون ور عزیزه برو بابا اینو خوب زودتر بگو دیدی کلی نداره بخش من رفتو داریم بالا که این جک و اینا رو چیز کنم با از اندون خدا نگردم فقط دفترچه تو داشت برده دیگه چه من نگاه نمی کنی ببینم من هستم خدمتون چرا؟ نه واقعی چرا بابا چند بار بیرم تو آزری هستی نه من نزدیکاش سمنان بدونی اون من هرود وای نه مزم مرد آزری آزر ماهی نه بیا بریم بالا من دیگه قهوه بخوریم من بعدی آلم ماجره تفرم نه 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 من اصلا قهوه دوست ندارم خب چایی دست رو داریم چایی نه خانم دست شما در نکنم هر سوالی هم داشتین ای بابا برو بر هر سوالی داشتین تشبیه بریم نمایندگی سوال کنیم خب میم بشه خودتون همش دیگه اصلا مرادی بله آقا از ببین اصلا آقا از ببین اینجا بیا اینم چکه آخ 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 همه تیگه هم نسته در یعنی این مودی قدمی خیلی هوا تو داشت زود بامه تا آماده کرده آره خدا رو شکر خودکار رو هم میدیم اصلاحات اشبا عشقی از جایی دیگه من خیلی از شما از خواهیم کنم از خواهی میکنم از خواهی میکنم is a verb it's a polite way of saying I'm sorry People usually use it when they want to have a formal conversation with someone, perhaps a teacher, a customer for their business, or older people. Bebakhshid. Bebakhshid is the general and common way of saying sorry to someone. You can either use it in a friendly conversation or more formal situation. Khushgele. Khushgele means it is beautiful. The word khushgel means beautiful and is usually used in less formal situations. Generally speaking, usually the word ast for Persian verbs turn into he and pronounced as e khushgele. So in this scene, basically, the woman is surprised to suddenly see flowers in her car and is expressing her feelings towards it. Ehsasati. <laughs> Ehsasati <laughs> is an adjective and is usually used for people who show their love and care about others by their actions or words. In this scene, the woman mistakenly believes that the man has bought those flowers for her, but the flowers belong to the man's wife, who was with them in the same car previously. Oops! <laughs> Cheese. Cheese literally means thing, but people use it in conversations for a completely different purpose. It doesn't have any particular meaning, we use it when we are unsure of what to say or in the situations we cannot recall what we are going to talk about. It can also be used when you are thinking about something and trying to remember the exact phrase, word or sentence. Something like er. So it's possible to use it instead of a noun or as the first part of the verbs we use in Persian. <laughs> This one is a question. It translates to, doesn't it bite? As you see in the video, the man is afraid of dogs. And he is asking the woman to make sure it doesn't harm him if he gets out of the car.
عزیزم عزیزم is the Persian equivalent of my dear and sweetie it's used to call or mention someone or something you love it can either be used for your partner your pets your family members etc this one translates to with your permission it's a way of requesting permission and informing the other person of the action you're going to do here the man is trying to leave the place and is trying to inform the woman of his decision politely. Khudanegahdar. Khudanegahdar is the Persian synonym of farewell. It translates to may God be your keeper and is used to say goodbye to someone politely and formally. <laughs> This one consists of two words, خدمت plus شما. The word خدمت means serve or duty. And we use this phrase to say someone in a polite way that you are ready to help or provide support for them in a way. Azari <laughs> Azari has two meanings. The first one an adjective for people who were born in the month of Azar. So Azar month is the ninth month on the Persian calendar and its symbol is similar to Sagittarius. The second meaning of Azari is the adjective used to address Turkish people of Iran who live in northwestern parts of the country. Most of them live in the city of Tabriz, which is also a tourist attraction in Iran. <laughs> Semnon. Semnon is the name of a province in Iran, and its center is Semnon city with the same pronunciation. Here, the woman is asking the man about his zodiac sign to know his personality better, but he doesn't understand her and thinks that she is asking about his birthplace. Ye alame. Ye alame means so many, a lot of. It's used in informal language and is usually used to mention a large quantity of something we are happy about. <laughs> hey, Baba. Hey, Baba literally means hey, Dad. Persian speakers often use it to show disapproval or frustration about something unpleasant. In this scene, the man sees that the dog is approaching him again and he is afraid of it. Fes fes kardan. You know, this one is also a verb and it means to linger or dawdle. It's used when we are unsatisfied with the result of something. When we believe that someone takes action so slowly and spends so much time on something unnecessary. Check it. Check it consists of two words. Check plus to. It means your check. The man has already requested a loan from his workplace and his co-worker is bringing him the check for the money. Damit garm. Damit garm is a very common conversational phrase in daily conversations, especially used by youngsters. It means big up to you, kudos to you, or nice job. 
We use it to express our happiness and satisfaction about something that someone else does. Havato dasht. Havato dasht is made up of the words havaye plus to plus ro plus dasht. So literally, the phrase means something like, they got your back, that person got your back. So the man's co-worker is telling him that their previous manager got his back and like him to accept his request quickly and give him the loan. Thank you guys so much for devoting your precious time to us. Do not forget if you have any further questions, we'll be more than happy to answer them all. Please write them down in the comments part and we'll be here assisting you. Also, our team would be more than happy to see you guys coming to our website for free educational content. We would like to help people all around the world to learn Farsi and Persian better. And do not forget, click on that subscribe button to be a part of our channel and turn on your notification icon to get informed about future posts. <laughs>